Let us find AMM first. It comes under chapter 24 electrical power and sub chapter AC external power control. We will find for installation of receptacle external power. This is the figure from our AMM. Fit number is 20 X-ray golf and access through forward emergency compartment door. For retalking, we will remove the rubber cover first. For that, we will remove four nuts and then we will retalk this four bigger nut and two smaller nut as per AMM. This is our installation steps. Just for the info, the talking value for each nut is not given in installation procedure, but we have to refer ESPM for that. So let us refer ESPM. So as per the part number of our receptacle, we will find the talking value. Talk value for the nut of control pin will be from 18 to 21 inch pound and for the nut of power pin will be from 76 to 84 inch pound. So we will give the nominal talk value. Let us start, we will go through forward avionics access door. Our receptacle is located just below the 90 view racks. Fin number is 20 X-ray golf. We will start with removing the rubber cover. We will loosen all four mounting nuts in diagonal pattern. As the cover is made of rubber, it was very tight fit. Pull the cover from all four sides equally so that it comes out parallel to the mounting easily and doesn't get stuck. So we'll remove the cover and these are the six nut which we will be re it to the prescribed value. Before re we will just loosen all the nuts little bit. For small control pin nuts, we are using direct reading dial type torque wrench. The inner circle is marked in inch pound which we need and the outer circle is marked with scan centimeter kilogram. In this type of torque wrench, the needle moves and gives us the current torque which we are giving on the nut. So in our case, we will stop at 20 inch pound. Due to no access, I couldn't take the video from top of the dial. For bigger nuts, we are using click type torque wrench. We will set it to 80 inch pound. For setting this type of torque wrench, we will just pull the locking ring and then we will rotate our handle until the zero reaches the 80 marking. So right now it is 76, 77, 78, 9 and 0. So it is right now on 80 inch pound. So we'll keep on giving the torque until we hear that click sound and then we feel the slip on the wrench. One of the precautions while using the torque wrench is you have to hold it on the proper position on the handle while giving the torque, otherwise you will cause an error due to leverage change. So our torquing is done, we will just recheck it and then we will install the rubber cover. Just push it from all four sides equally so that it fits properly and equally from all the side and then we will install the nuts.
If you like the video please hit the like button and subscribe our channel press bell icon for notification of our latest video keep watching thank you